Okay, this is the Insulinx meter from Abbott, part of its freestyle range. So Insulinx, as in linking to insulin, it's actually taking what you might call pump technology, um, as some of the other meters are these days. So they go beyond just blood testing and logging what you do, but it goes into not just even showing patterns, but it allows you to start looking at how your insulin works for you in terms of your sensitivity and your ratios of insulin to carbohydrates. And because that information is necessary and because it goes into the machine and it then influences the dose it suggests for you, hence calculating your insulin dose, that's the reason why these are only available from your diabetes specialist nurse. You'd need to have the knowledge about your insulin sensitivity and your carbs to insulin ratio to go into the machine and set it up. Uh, because the thing that the meter or blood glucose system is what they tend to be calling these machines now, is that it's got on board a bolus wizard. Now, anyone using a pump's familiar with it. And anyone using a pump won't need one of these because the pump's pretty much already doing it. This meter and some of the others out there, notably the AccuCheck expert from Roche, help you to keep track of carbs and it will actually help you do some of the maths by using an algorithm inside the meter based on your insulin sensitivity and your insulin to carbohydrate ratio to give you advice on what to dose yourself up with. They're always called boluses these days. I mean, in the old days it was a shot. So it's, it's whatever your short acting insulin shot is gonna be. And that might vary in terms of your ratios in different times of the day. There's other videos on this site about insulin sensitivity and your carbohydrate to, your insulin to carbohydrate ratios, if you want to go and look at those further. It's easy to use the sensor. There's a little butterfly on there, which is part of the freestyle branding, and you see it through all of this, but there are actually little markers that help you to know how to make this all work, especially if you're new to diabetes um, or to some of the more advanced meters. So your butterfly is facing up, so you see it. The slightly more sort of graphic pattern at the top goes in, and the blood channel is right at the bottom there. The other great thing, the great advance about this meter is it's got a huge screen. So it's basically taken a lot of sort of mobile phone technology, the way you know the other gadgets in our life are moving and changing. And it actually shows you how to apply the blood. Um, in this case, it's not on the bottom, it's on the side. So I'll just, I'll just quickly do that bit and then I'll show you some of the other graphics that are available. And then I'll sh the, the sort of sucker punch about this machine. So there we go. In that goes. Nice little butterfly, flippy flapping around there, which is very nice. Um, and a result, and it is actually telling me that I've got a high glucose. Uh, so in case I wasn't aware of that, it is telling me. Now what you can do is go in and use the calculator. And it is touch screen, which is rather good fun. Um, it's asking me, have you taken any rapid acting insulin since 8.15? Um, and the answer is yes, I have. And how many units did I have? I had four units. And I had it quite a long time ago. I'm going to say an hour and a half. Next. This dose of insulin will be used in the calculation of your suggested dose. Next, enter what you plan to eat, which is actually nothing, so I'll do done. And suggested dose is zero, which I agree with. I wouldn't give myself, even if it told me to, I wouldn't actually give myself any insulin because I think that my insulin that I took two and a half hours ago is basically doing its big thing right now and I'm going to end up coming down. So that's one of the things you can do. Um, because of the level of knowledge about diabetes control that you need for this machine, it's already pre... I'd, I'd got this from my um, DSN, my diabetes specialist nurse, and it's already preloaded with my insulin sensitivity and my carbohydrate to insulin ratio. 
just for information, these are the batteries. These are the batteries, so it's the flat round discs that go in the top there. The, the, what, what I haven't done either on this meter is you can actually connect it to your computer and choose for one of the home screens, you can personalize it with a photo that you like. 